of you did vote for Alien Isolation, but as we're watching the intro cutscene, um, Fallout New Vegas officially won four, I mean five to four, which surprised me. I fully expected you guys to go totally, to totally go Alien Isolation on me and make me scream my head off. So instead, here we are, watching the Legion Raiders. And this is kind of good prep. Um, I hope I can finish this series before November, before Fallout 4 comes out, so we can go straight from War. New Vegas to Fallout 4. War never changes. When atomic fire consumed the Earth, those who survived did so in great underground vaults. I've when never actually opened, watched the intro Their inhabitants scene. set out across the ruins of the old world to build new societies. So, establishing villages, I'm kind of going to sit back tribes. and let the narrator talk. As so decades passed, what had been the American but Southwest... Don't worry, there's going to be a lot of heavy editing with this one. I may record for an hour and a half. I may only Republic, use 45 minutes of it. Dedicated to old world um, values of democracy and the rule of law. As the Republic grew, so did its needs. Scouts spread east, seeking territory and wealth in the dry and merciless expanse of the Mojave Desert. They returned with tales of a city untouched by the warheads that had scorched the rest of the world and a great wall spanning the Colorado River. The Hoover Dam. The NCR Duh. mobilized its army and sent it east to occupy Hoover Dam and restore it to working condition. But across the Colorado, another society had arisen under a different flag. A vast army of slaves forged from the conquest of 86 tribes, Caesar's Legion. Four sure years really have passed since guys. the Republic held the dam, just barely, against the Legion's onslaught. The Legion did not retreat. Across the river, it gathers strength. Campfires burn, training drums. Through it all, the New Vegas Strip has stayed open for business. You know, under the control the tank girl, of its mysterious I think I have a very simple solution to the NCR. Build a tank! And his army of rehabilitated tribal and police I mean, think robots. Think about it. How awesome would it be to have a tank in Fallout New Vegas? Nobody you can really fight you. are a courier, you. hired by the Mojave Express to deliver a package to the New Vegas Strip. Okay, I'll deliver a package. What seemed like a simple delivery job has taken a turn for the worse. Hey then. You got what you were after, so pay up. You're crying in the rain, Pally. <laughs> Guess who's waking up over here? Time to cash out. Will you get it over with? Maybe cons kill people without looking them in the face. But I ain't a fink, dig? You've made your last delivery, kid. Sorry you got twisted up in this scene. From where you're kneeling, must seem like an 18-carat run of bad luck. Just a bit. Truth is, the game was rigged from the start. You dick! So that's... See, I never actually watched that. I didn't actually know that you literally just got shot in the head to start the game. That's a hell of a way to start a game. I'm gonna shoot you in the head. What? I mean, I watched the film theorist, but I just assumed that this was like that it was a cutscene that wasn't that I hadn't actually seen yet. But no, apparently it's the opening cutscene that just happened. Oh, do not tell me. Okay, you didn't lock it for me. Yeah, yeah, I have I have a bunch of the expansions. Let's give them here. Oh god, that is like 
Ah, that is like you vertigo wait. inducing. I'm up. Ah. I'm waking up. Give me a minute. Whoa, easy there. Easy. You've been out cold a couple of days now. Why don't you just relax a second? Get your bearings. There's a lot of gear that I'm just getting for free. How about your name? Can you tell me your name? There we go. I can't say it's what I'd have picked for you, but if that's your name, that's your name. Hey, now. I'm Doc Mitchell. Welcome to Good Springs. Now, I hope you don't mind, but I had to go rooting around there in your noggin to pull all the bits of lead out. I take pride in my needlework, but you'd better tell me if I left anything out of place. That's... Okay, I'm not quite sure I wanted you to operate on me now. Oh, hell no. Um, yeah, we'll just go with the preset. Why not? Um, it, it, I could literally have been here designing this for hours. Well, it I makes more sense to get right into the anyway. game and just go with Stuff the preset and smile. Okay. No sense keeping you in bed anymore. Let's see if we can get you on your feet. Oh, good. I'm not paralyzed. I'm just mildly blinded. Good. Why don't you walk down to the end of the room? Over by that bigger tester machine. Take it slow now. It ain't a race. Ooh, looking good so far. Go ahead and give the bigger tester a try. Okay, so we'll learn right quick. I'm gonna get my stats set up. And then we're gonna go from here. Let's see. That's fine. I really like my ranged weapons. Um, I would like more hit points, please. Uh, I like being able to talk to people. Make me smart. Make me agile. Um, I can be a little unlucky. That's fine. Make me really agile. So here is our special. Five six 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 seven four. I can live with that. Yeah, that's a pretty standard score there. But after what you've been through, I'd say that's great news. Oh, I can take that. Well, we and know that. your vitals and are that. good. And that. But that okay. don't mean them bullets. He's not complaining, so I'm just gonna keep taking. Ooh, what's this? A, a laser pistol? Don't mind if I do. I'll take these cigarettes because those actually go for some money. Take a seat in my couch and do, 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 do. Oh, Doctor Fact, don't mind if I do. He's not saying a word. May as well loot the room if he's not going to say anything about it. Don't have the ability to do that one. Alright, what do you got for me, Doc? Alright. I'm going to say a word. I want you I'm just going to pick the most outrageous answer instead of the first thing Dog. that comes to mind. Dog. Um... Dinner. House. House. Uh, hmm. Burglarize. Night. Night. Okay. Treasure. Bandit. Bandit. Um. Reasonable. Light. Cause that's a total thing in Fallout, isn't it? Bandits are reasonable on every level. Uh, light. Heavy seems like the weirdest answer. Mother. Mother. Human shield! Sometimes when you give tests like this, you learn more than you was hoping for, and I reckon that ain't always the best. But I guess maybe it ex Okay. Just a little now, bit I about my predicament, and you know that I'm completely that shit like crazy. Conflict is my nature. Hell yes. I ain't given to relying on... Nope, they can totally help. I'm always fixed. Sure, why not? I'm slow to embrace new. If it ain't broke, don't fix it, but if it works, use it. On. Oh, yeah. Almost done here. What do you say you have a look at this? Tell me what you see. Uh, I see a person sitting upside down, but I don't think that's an option. No, it's not. Um. 
I could see the two headed angry ants. Okay. Well, we all know what it looks like because we're all perverts. But I'm gonna go with that. Last one. See to me this looks like two ninjas just going, high five! Seriously though, that's what it looks like to me. Um Is a bearded guy? Let's see what you came up with. Energy weapons, science, and speech. Nope. Uh-uh. Not happening. Uh, lockpick. Science. Sure, we'll keep the science. We'll keep the science. Because science. Then we'll go with speech. Wow. It was only off by one. I'm impressed. And I was just getting with the most Before ridiculous I answers I could loose, see. I need one more thing from you. I got a form for you to fill out so I can get a sense of your medical history. Just a formality. Ain't like I My medical I history? A family history of getting shot in the head. Well, what if I do have a family history of getting shot in the head? What then? Seriously. Um, I always take skilled. I mean, I know it's less experience, but five points on every single skill is actually pretty damn useful. And I can deal with having less XP. Um, hmm. Trigger discipline. You know what? Yeah, trigger discipline. Because I don't mind shooting more slowly if I'm more accurate. Especially in a game All in which right. I know I'm going to be limited on ammo. Way. Because this Come is going to be played on hardcore mode. Here, these are. See, Dash didn't know you could catch him before he left. You yep. didn't actually have to meet him at the door, you can actually catch him right here. Yes, we're gonna play hardcore mode. I'm gonna go loot the rest of your house. And looting the house, because you know what? It's what adventurers do. You loot the whole house, and technically we are an adventurer, even if we do live in a desert. carrying so much weight already because of all the stuff the pack gives you out the gate, which is just, it's a bunch of stuff that I, that I just sell. I, I, I would turn them off if I could, but they came with the game, so may as well use them. Scotch, nuts, going on a stick, because I know I'm going to need food, and if you're going to give me free food, I will take free food. Anything in here? Nope. Okay, uh, out the door! Let's get him. Oh! I don't mind if I do. Take all your caps. Oh! Just a little bright! Don't mind me! Only partially blind now! And this is gonna be a very, very long term game. I mean might be months before I get through all this. I might sit down sometimes and just do stuff that's not really all that interesting. Just so you guys aren't sitting through all of it. And remember, you guys are also going to have stuff like, you know, this scene. Howdy. Well, you must come be back the one doctor. I I'm go in the tavern. Back in the saloon. Cheyenne, Hello there. Stay. Don't worry. She won't bite unless I tell her to. Good to know. Yeah. This is the only way to get the the super good reputation in Good Springs is to actually do the freaking tutorial. God, they don't make this easy. All right, uh, Vault Twenty One jumpsuit is not all that useful. Um, Lightweight level burners probably the best bet. Let's just go around her and make this express. 
Wow. That has to be like the fastest I've ever seen someone cover ground. You got out the door before I did. Now, see the sarsaparilla bottles on the fence there? Take this and try to hit a couple of them. Okay. Bang. That's the gotcha. right idea. Look on the side. Try crouching down and staying still. It'll help your aim. Nice shot. Well, that's a start. Now, as nice as the varmint rifle is, it's kind of useless. Which is why I brought this thing. And we're going to use the weapon repair kit so that I now have a decently repaired 9mm. Oh, by the way, I also found something else. Do, do, do. Uh, not extended bag. Twenty round clip for a nine mil. That's just mean. Do, 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 do. Okay, gonna fast forward again to the geckos that we all know is coming up, right? Okay, and here we are at the at the Good Springs. Uh -oh, there, protect me. Ooh, you have no face, Gecko. Who else wants some? Oh, I see you there. You see me too, huh? Right between the eyes. All right, let's reload the gun. Where's Sunny? Did I really outrun her? No, she just didn't really get into the fight at all. See? You're getting me. Come with Alright, let's head down here. See what we can see. You just gave me like a fuck ton of ammo that I'm probably not even gonna use. Oh, there's some geckos. Oh wow, there. Headshot in the side, in one ear, out the other for spite purposes. All right, now they get the super good reputation because I have to rescue. Oh shit, she's gonna get beat the fuck up. Don't die. You're alive, aren't you? Holy moly. I... You're welcome. Yay, reputation. Anything valuable on you? Well, you have your hide and an egg. And some meat I can make steaks out of. Mmm. Mutant gecko steak. It's what's for breakfast. I know you were all expecting me to say it's what's for dinner. Nah, nah, we're gonna have it for breakfast. Or iguana on a stick. That sounds lovely. I'll beat you down here again. You didn't even get involved. Now that was some good work. Here, one more. up. Nah, I'm good. Go say hi to Trudy. Okay. I wanna see what this guy wants. Hey, dude. So you got a sidearm. Hello? Can you help me? Can you stop covering your face? My girl is trapped by geckos on the ridge. Really? And I can't get... You're afraid of geckos. Well, I just killed a fuck ton of them. This should be easy. I mean, it's not like you could possibly betray me or be lying to me or anything. Yeah, let's go up here and kill some geckos. This shouldn't be too much of a problem. We're fine.
Ah. I hit him. Hit him again. He's still coming. Nope, he's running. They don't use hit skins, by the way. They use actual bullet physics, so sometimes you just miss the target. Okay, it ran away. I get the distinct feeling it has friends. Yes, I know. I'm in danger. Remember, I only think that they are really in front of me. Oh, nope, there's one up there. Let's get up on the rocks where they can't get to us because apparently jumping is too hard. Despite the fact they leap at you when they attack you. No, can't get me. Can't get me. There you are. Ah, come on, hit it, hit it. There we go. Gotcha. Didn't really hurt you that much. That's my trusty nine millimeter. How many shots are you gonna take? Whoa! Get away! No! Bad! Bad gecko! Oh crap, I'm starting to break my gun. Alright, uh you know what? Because geckos deserve overkill now. You actually hit me? It hurt a little bit. I, I'm not really sorry for what I'm about to do to you. Overkill is always fun. Besides, it instantly cooks gecko steak. Grimmercenary grenade rifle. Who knew it was good for cooking? I can't believe I said those words. Hmm, so many gecko hides. And I'm gonna take two more meat, which will give me enough for steak. Gecko steak. Assuming I can even make it yet. Um, there's duct tape. And baseballs. Ah! Ow! did not notice that bear trap till it was a bit too late. Apparently I do not have a repair skill of 23 or higher. Uh, I'll take the scotch and the squirrel and the nuts. Where's your... Is this your... That's definitely not your girlfriend. That's definitely a guy. I'll take the bottle caps though. And the ammo box. Mm, just a pistol I can sell. I don't really like the 10 mils. No, don't know why, I just don't like them. Alright, coming down off the mountain. I, your girlfriend's not up here unless she's one of these, uh... The long since devoured corpses. I don't think she's up here. Why do I feel like I've been lied to? Have I been lied to? It's been so long since i played this game. I don't remember much of it. Sorry I tricked you, but thanks for clearing out the geckos. Now I can get to that stash up there, after I deal with you. Well, if I hit the target, that'd be nice. After you deal with who? I brought a grenade launcher. What did you bring? A 9 mil. Thanks for the 9 mil ammo. I kind of needed that. I was running out. Ooh, Mentats, those are always good. At least last time I remember, they're always a good thing to have. Okay, and now we travel back to Good Springs. So, uh, we're gonna take a quick cut. See you in a second.
You looking to buy some supply? soon i'm going to get my friends and we're burning this town to the you ground you don't sound like a nice person we'll keep that in mind and you're wearing an ncr no, uniform i don't know how much get i like out. you if at all well you've been causing quite a stir glad i finally got to meet you i did welcome to what the did prospector saloon all right and we're back uh apparently i need to go talk to trudy i'm done being nice if you don't hand ringo over soon I'm going to get my friends, and we're burning this town to the ground. You don't ground. sound like a nice person. We'll keep that in mind. And you're wearing an NCR no, uniform. I don't know how much get I out. like you, if at all. Well, you've been causing quite a stir. Glad I finally got to meet you. I did. Welcome to what the Prospector Saloon. Looks like our little town got itself dragged into the middle of something we don't want anything to do with. About that a week ago, bad. this traitor Ringo comes into town. Survive. We figured he was just in shock, so we gave him a place to lie low. We didn't actually expect anyone to come after him. That doesn't sound like it's a good thing. Cobb hasn't exactly been looking for Ringo too hard. I think he's afraid that Ringo will ambush him, which is probably true. Hmm. You mean murder him? That's... He's whole... Some of the... Personally, I hope he sneaks out of town one night and takes the power... Outer gangers? Chain gangs, really. The NCR brought them in oh. from California to work on the rail lines. That makes sense now. Problem is, it turns out that giving convicts a bunch of dynamite and blasting powder isn't the best idea. This sounds like a was horrible a idea. Who came ago. up with this? Some of them stuck together so they could make trouble. That's what we're dealing with now. Not much, other than there are a bunch of freeloaders who expected a few rounds on the house. I was able to get them to pay up, though. Of course, one of the great cons did knock my radio to the floor by accident, and it hasn't been working since. Oh. They were having some kind of argument about it, but mm -hmm. the guy in the checkered coat kept shushing them. Mm. Sounded like they came in from the north through Quarry Junction. If that's the case, I can't say I blame them for not wanting to go back. I'm trying to Quarry Junction. That whole area is overrun with the kind of critters that just get mad if you shoot them. Oh. Merchants avoid that whole stretch of I-15 like it's radioactive, which it could be for all I know. That... I didn't hear exactly, but the leader was talking about the strip. Oh. Fellow wants to get there and avoid the 15, he'd have to go east. Take Highway 93 up. Okay. Makes sense. If you were able to get Ringo out of this mess, you'd have a decent reputation around really Good Springs. Now. I'd even set you up with a discount. I like of course, that helping idea. Ringo would also make the powder gangers mad, and they've got a lot of friends out there. Don't know why you'd want to do a thing like that. Yep, you'd get on their good side. Okay. Sure, the outside looks okay. But radio. All right, that's all the information I really need. Hey, I leveled up. Sweet. Um, let's make this quick and dirty. Um, I actually like taking these two, but then there's not really a lot of chance to use them throughout the entire game, if I remember right. So we're going to go with intense training. Um, let's make ourselves more agile. Get out of the way. Come on, get out of the way. Here we go. Radio. Fix it. Feeling thirsty? Fix your radio. Ah, not at all. I'm never sure how much is normally charged for this sort of thing. Here's some additional caps. That should be enough. Thank you. Now, how about spending some? Sure. Let's see what you have for sale. Be right back. Okay. That. Just to get some extra weight off.
Thanks. All right, so uh, let's go meet this Ringo fellow. Not quite sure how I feel about somebody named after one of the Beatles. Not that's necessarily a bad thing. Um, so let's go meet him. That's close enough. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who are you? And what do you want with me? I ain't even got a gun out. Let's uh let's not get too hasty here. Um, I'm not your enemy. Sorry about the gun. You just caught me off guard, that's all. We got off to you a seem bad to have start. That effect on what say we start over with a friendly game of caravan? Yeah. He doesn't look very tough though. I hear he's afraid I'll shoot him down from one of the windows when I see him. And he's right. Oh. Have You're the kind that shoots somebody in the back. I'm gonna lay low for as long as I can, assuming the town doesn't throw me to the wolves. I don't think they will. Alright, so, uh, let's go meet this Ringo fellow. Not quite sure how I feel about somebody named after one of the Beatles. Not that's necessarily a bad thing. Um, so let's go meet him. That's close enough. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who are you? And what do you want with me? I ain't even got a gun out. Let's uh let's not get too hasty here. Um I'm not your enemy. Sorry about the gun. You just caught me off guard, that's all. We got off to you a seem bad to have start. That effect on Let's say we start over with a friendly game of caravan. Yeah. He doesn't look very tough though. I hear he's afraid I'll shoot him down from one of the windows when I see him. And he's right. Oh. Um, You're the kind that shoots somebody in the back. I'm gonna lay low for as long as I can, assuming the town doesn't throw me to the wolves. I don't think they will. I've got no chance against the gang on my own. Well, what if the whole town helps you out? We just end up sharing the same grave if it's just the two of us. Now, if some of the other people in town were also on board... I think I could arrange that. Start with Sunny Smiles. She's been friendlier than most around here. Okay, I will totally do this thing uh, after I unequivocally loot the room! Oh, come on, if you're gonna be an adventurer, you may as well be an adventurer. Yeah, he sees me. What's in here? Why would they keep caps in a cash register? Ooh. Ooh. I got it. Caps. Um. Let's get a nice jet, because that's always fun. Um. Yeah, the rest of this I don't really need, and everybody in town's currently out of caps. Do I do it? Meant I could use your 20 mil rounds. I don't care. I need the bullets. All right, so let's go round some people up, shall we? I mean, uh, how hard could this possibly be if the entire town looks at the powder gangers and goes, "Fuck you!" Then again, that could work out very badly. Either way, let's let's go get us a posse. Cause Fiora, Fiora feels like she needs a posse for this one. Hey, Sunny. Hi there. Sticking. Yeah, I'm gonna stick around a little longer. Say no more. I'm in. That was easy. Joe Carr talks exactly. about leaving us alone if we hand over Ringo. But I know his type. He and his friends will come after the town eventually. However, between you, me, and Ringo, we aren't exactly a force to be reckoned with. A lot of people around here look up to Trudy. If you could convince Trudy to join us, some of the folks in town might decide to help out as well. People are in this town. I know I only see like got a eight stock of buildings somewhere. that are standing. Chet just got a shipment of leather armor we could borrow. Talk to them as well. Finally, there's a good chance we'll all end up with extra holes in us. So if Doc Mitchell could cough up some extra stim packs, that'd be great. Basically, you want me to go around and get a fuck ton of gear. 
I'll be waiting. Okay. Well, Trudy's right here. This will be easy. So you're planning on taking on Joe Cobb's gang? It's a big risk, but I suppose you have to do what you think is right. I have speech. I was planning on sitting this one out, but for some reason, I can't help but like you. I guess it's I'm that with you. southern Let me charm. have a word with a few other folks, and I'll see if I can't round up some more members for this militia you're creating. While everyone does own a gun, we could stand to be a little better equipped. The general store probably has what we need in stock. Okay. I'm gonna go talk to Chet. Oh, there's Dynamite Pete. I forgot to do something, so forgive me for one moment. That has to go away. Because I'm pretty sure the music in the game is copyrighted. Hey, Easy Pete. Howdy. What can Easy Pete do for you? I heard you got some dynamite. Want to kill all yourselves if I let you touch it? Better to leave it buried, safer that way. I think uh -huh. I know what I'm doing Guess with explosives. You, know you guys doing. think I'm knowing what I'm doing I'll with explosives? I'll go dig it up and get it ready. You'll have it by the time the fighting starts. Okay. I mean, do you guys do you guys trust me with TNT? I mean, what's the worst that could happen? Let's not go there. Because I guarantee you the worst is going to happen. I'm going to end up killing myself repeatedly, crippling myself, or otherwise causing major issues from my internal organs with my own dynamite. Just because I said something. Hey, chat. You looking to buy some supplies? Nope, looking to steal some from you. If Ringo doesn't head out on his own, I think... Don't mistake that for coward talk, though. We're a town of survivors. We'll fight tooth and nail if pushed. But we don't go looking for trouble. Now just hold on. I never voted to take on the powder gangers. That's a thousand you cap investment you're talking about. Douche. <sighs> Fine, I actually have the cap. That's more like it. The people can pick up their extra ammo and leather armor when they're ready. Was there anything else? Dick. I'm gonna be right back in the Robin blind. Can do. Of course, you have. I just gave you a thousand caps, but you have zero caps. So much of that big starting bonus, it's all gone now. God. What a rip. Thanks, BioWare. I just made a thousand caps disintegrate from the game world. Oh wait, this is Obsidian and Bethesda, not Bioware. Well, thanks, Obsidian. Hope stuff like that doesn't happen in Armored Warfare. Hey, Doc. Welcome back. I had hoped you wouldn't need to come see me again so soon. What can I do for you? Oh, I'm fine. I just... Seems like wherever I go, it's always the same. Folks just never leave each other alone. Oh, I'm not much good in a fight with my bum leg. And my supplies are scarce. But I'll give you what I can spare. Okay, thanks, Doc. That's that's awfully nice of you. Okay, so we are... Oh, well, while we're here, uh, let's go ahead and just down a stem back because I took some damage earlier. Okay, uh... Uh oh. That's saying, looks like the fighting's about to be starting. Let's go get Ringo. Got my leather armor and got my trusty 9mm with the extended magazine. Can't wait to get the, the other modifications for it. Also, can't wait to see the stuff from Fallout 4's modification system. All right, so, hey, Ringo. So what's going on? Yep, Sonny's with us. Well, I guess that... Let's do All this right, shit. Ready. Time to look alive. The Powder Gangers are here to play. That was quick. At least six. Joe Cobb included. They look pretty mean. I'll be set up near the store. Ooh, Let's I got TNT. All right, so we're going to run up here. Let's get our dinamite. Dinamite. It says inert on the side of the... Can I really trust this explosive to actually work? 
Alright, we got random dude. We got Trudy, who's still in her dress. I ain't even gonna wait for you to say anything. Fire in the hole. Ow, ow, that actually hurt. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, that's enough. You with the baseball bat. Okay, we need to get out of the pistol, because obviously I'm killing myself with a damn dynamite. Bring a baseball bat to a gun. I'll blow your kneecaps off! Alright, that's it. We're gonna use bats. You! I know how this works. At least I think I do. Uh, let's blow your kneecaps off and that arm. Sure. Oh, you don't have a leg! That 9mm pistol took your whole leg. You, douchebag. Drop your weapon. Blow your kneecaps. And then I'm gonna pop you in the back. For spite purposes. I said go down! Woohoo! They idolized me! I'm so famous in... Good Springs. I think this town is literally bumfuck nowhere, if I remember right. Right, guys? I mean, this, t this town is so small. Uh, power gangers don't like me. What you got? Place with dynamite. That's kind of nice. More dynamite, because I like explosives. I owe you a huge favor for this. Here, these are technically Crimson Caravan funds, but... I know they'll understand once I explain things. Really now? A corporation I'll stick understanding once you explain things. Explain. I, 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 wanna, I wanna be present for that conversation. I really do. Hey bud. I will totally take your revolver. Did not do you any good. Alright guys, so... Um, we got through the opening. Not a half bad job, if I do say so myself. But in the meantime, I do believe I need to wrap this one up. Got got us through the opening. Got us through getting idolized in Good Springs. Yay. Let's see. Where do we want to go next? Um, well, they said they headed south. So I guess next time we're going to go pick up... We're going to head south and just see what's there. I think there's a town called Prim, if I remember right. I haven't played this in a long time. In a long time. Ooh, another body. Must loot. Must loot body. Oh, he's got some cigarettes. Anyway, so we are going to head down to Prim for the next time. So in the meantime, this is Fiora officially signing out for right now. And I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Thank y'all for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and if you did, why not click the like button? It would really help the channel and let me know that you're enjoying my content. Want to see more content? There's a subscribe icon right there so you know when I put up videos. I would appreciate it also if you helped grow this channel's community. So share this with your friends or just put it up on Facebook. Want to help Fiora out directly? There are three ways you can do this. One is the patronage page, which all the investment towards I put right back into the channel through contests and paying for things like video editing software. Then there are two ways to support the channel directly. One is click the ads that YouTube shows you. This is how YouTube pays its content creators, by your clicks on those advertisements. The other and last way to support the channel is through fan funding that is now available through Fiora's channel page. If you happen to have an extra dollar or two, it would really let Fiora know that her videos mean something to you. Anyway, please check out these other videos here on the end page collage. And as always, I will see you on the battlefield or in the next video. Till then, this is Fiora signing out.